Leaving Moscow, heading to LA, and I'm trying to find the best Russian gift I can get my mother or some people. So, what do you guys think? I'm thinking Matryoshka. <laughs> maybe this little chunky one. She has a, maybe she had too much of vodka or beer. Santa Claus. Oh, this is cute. It's cute, right? Venice Beach. Um, it is really, really hot. It's November and it's like 90 degrees. So right now I just want to kind of chill out by the water. And after that, I'm going to take you guys closer to more of the Venice environment. So, well, I'll see you when we get there. But actually this water is about as cold as it is in Russia right now. <laughs> but the sun helps it out, balances. Right over here is now the blue mountains. And I'm gonna take you this way, which is a more famous area, uh, more famous area of um, Venice.
of the coolest skate parks in Venice Beach. This is where everybody comes and shows off their skills. I'm gonna show you guys a little bit. Not that I'll be skating personally, but it should be pretty cool. It's rugged. I'm a country girl. If you guys didn't know, born and raised in Virginia. Country girl. So I want a really rough and rugged truck one day. <laughs> but at the same time, I want a Mercedes Benz. So I don't know. I need both, I guess. See this, uh, I don't know about this house. They have a lot of stone people living out front. It's like bars everywhere, it's kind of scary. Like maybe they're holding somebody hostage inside. All right, so I'm about to go hiking up the wisdom tree. Got all these waters here, about three waters, and I snuck in a Red Bull. And yeah, I can't wait to show you guys the top. I hope I make it. tree here it is here it's this little tiny thing it's not too big actually it's pretty small but so many people come here and put their 
wishes, I guess. They write them down. There's like a little box where everybody writes their wishes down here. Here, over here, is the Hollywood sign. Uh, that over there is downtown LA. So, right over here is one of the studios, and right beside it is my local house. I can see Bank of America, which is right beside my house, and it's crazy. So, we're not too far. Okay, I did it. That was intense. If you can turn around, you can see all the way up there, the American flag. That's where I went. It is hot. I should have did this earlier in the day, in the morning, but the sun is pretty strong now, so it's kind of difficult to hike, but it was great. I feel great. Now I just need a big bottle of water. Maybe a salad or something. After you hike, you feel like you can accomplish anything. You feel powerful, you feel confident, like, wow, I really did that. It's great. All right, so we're heading to Beverly Center. I changed from hiking. I feel refreshed and powerful and confident. And I just want to show you guys some of, like, West Hollywood, some of Beverly Hills, and just show you different parts of LA. something going on here today looks like maybe some type of concert traditional it's called tree lighting so everybody comes when they're gonna show the tree lit for the first time in the year and it's really exciting and it's really beautiful in New York they do it at the Rockefeller Center and so here they're doing it at the Grove tonight and of course we came on the day where it is the most busy it looks like the stores may be closing early there's a bunch of people it's crazy but we're going to try to get some shock again before they close. Cool Gucci store actually. So 
It's pretty fancy. They have great food and restaurants over here too. It's all the way to the west of the lake uh, in Beverly Hills. So I'm going to show you guys all around Rodeo Drive. Taking a walk around Beverly Hills. It's a really, really cute neighborhood. It's very quiet and the houses are beautiful. Sometimes it's good to just come here and walk around. Especially when the weather is great. Today it's like 90 degrees. It's like maybe Celsius like plus 30 or more. So I just want to show you guys some of the areas around this cute little neighborhood. 